on action. All right, so we are here. We're watching the short film Submitten, directed by Susumu Kimura. It's currently streaming on Dust, and today was the premiere day. Uh, we're super excited. Uh, we did one of these before, and we were at 7,000 views. And now, about eight hours later, we're at 22,000 views. Yay! So things are Yay! things are going wild. Thank you. I think it's pretty cool. <laughs> so, uh, Susumu, why don't you start us off? Introduce yourself. Hello, my name is Susumu Kimura. I'm the writer, director, editor of this film, Submitten. And I am so, so, so uh, thanks, thankful that you guys are... Uh, um check this film um and uh especially thanks to dust and their team they are amazing mm -hmm. um thanks to them we got this platform to you know showcase our film our passion project for past uh, couple years um um Sharon before covid and now it's out there and Last year was all film festival now it's out there online and then sharing to the world and you know, um, sharing our little message of hope, and, and I hope you enjoy it. And thank you very much. Moving oh, on to you. moving on to producer. All right, I guess so. Uh, I'm Cameron A. Yeah. Mitchell. I'm one of the producers on the film. Uh, I came on board, I think, three or four days before we were shooting, and it was a lot of work, but we got it done. And I got a really good, solid friend and teammate in Susumu, and I'm really happy that I got involved. So. Uh, Mia, why don't you tell us who you are? Yes, yes. Hi, uh, thank you so much for watching. Um, my name is Mia Ando. I play the protagonist. And I just want to express uh, my gratitude uh, to you all. Um, we are so grateful for all the love and support we've been receiving, um, especially today. It's just amazing to see how people... 22,000 views. React to, views. The, react to 22,000 views in like nine hours. It's just so, it broke my mind. And so thank you so much for those of you who watched it and left the comments uh, with such kind of, you know, such kind and heartwarming comments for us. So, so we are so, so happy to hear them and read them and I appreciate we appreciate all of you very much so thank you mm. Momoka you want to go next uh yeah sure um hi Momoka Takahashi and I played the role of Greta in Submin and um I was very honored to play this part with everyone the cast and the crew it was such a nice experience um I love uh shooting short films and So thank you so much. Yay. Yay. Thank you. I feel like my daughter is talking or something, you know? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, nice. Molly, you want to go next? Hi, my name is Molly Flanagan. I play Molly in this short film, and she's definitely one of the bad guys um, <laughs> with big corporations. Uh, yeah. And uh, I, again, want to say thank you so much to Susumu and everybody on this project for also giving me the opportunity to be on it because it was honestly such a pleasure and i'm so proud of this film every time i see it it's just more and more exciting and more and more beautiful so i'm really happy it's on this platform and thank you to everyone that's watching thank you yeah. right all right hey i'm ray Hi. mars i play the role of derek in this who is like a uh, landlord, property manager, and um, is just is one of the elements that kind of brings this, this sense of realism. It's a real world that it's that everyone is a part of here. And I'm just super excited, super blessed to have been a part of this and um, loved every moment from the day one all the way up through now. It's just been a blast. And I'm so, so excited now to share this with everybody. And uh, yeah, and I'm so glad that people are responding and have, getting something out of this. So yeah. Yeah, I think guys. it's really, really cool that not only are we getting all these views, which is amazing, but also yes. that people are really Thank engaging and commenting. And, yeah. You know, mm -hmm. Susumu's, yes. 
So Sumu has so far answered every single comment because he's an insane person. Um, <laughs> we want to see if that keeps up, if he's able to continue I'll try. I'll try every remember. single comment. Yes. <laughs> but also he's got a job and a family and you know, all these other things. So who knows? Yeah. Maybe let's if you see, comment, it, you'll hear from him, maybe not. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Um, yeah. But uh, I guess without further ado, let's start the movie, shall we? All right. Yes. So this is the second uh, watching of this movie commentary mm -hmm. session. And here we go. Dust. That really cool Thank, you, dust. Dust. Thank, Thank you. you, Dust. Thank you, Dust. Thank you, Dust. Oh, I don't hear it. You don't hear? Oh, oh me too. Uh, I don't hear it. Actually, yeah, yeah I, I don't hear it either. Hold on. Oh, no. Let me Let's just go check. Back. I'll, I'll just go up a little. More tell me if you can hear it. Well, it's like it's not quiet. It's mm -hmm. the audio is not connected. Oh, okay. That must be me. Hold on a second. Uh, We're gonna keep recording because I don't know what happens if I stop recording. Uh, We're just gonna be dancing. <laughs> Impromptu. Did you, did we have stop? We... No, I'm still recording. <laughs> did you stop recording? No, I'm still no, recording. It's still on. Yeah. Um, cause I can always cut it too. So no worries. Cause I don't, I don't know what happens if I stop recording. I don't know if it right. <laughs> breaks the file, but we had an impromptu dance party on set. So we should have one in here too. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Did we? I... Yeah. You don't remember the dance party? I don't. It when was when we were, happen? it was when we were uh, filming the bus stuff. The, first the setup was taking such a long time. I think I hear it when you do this. Really? I, I don't remember that. I, I can hear it now, Susumu. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. You can hear it now. Yeah. Oh yeah. Now right, I so, remember. Yeah. Round two, take two. Submit <laughs> and watch party. Action. Action. Can't believe you don't remember the dance party, Mia. I now I remember. We did the uh, like. <laughs> Kusuma did uh, Radio yeah, Taiso. Uh, we did we did stretches we did, uh, and then we did dance. Stretch dances. and then we did dance. Now yeah. I remember. <laughs> yeah. Woo! Woo! <laughs> All of you yeah. can see it? Yeah, we can see it. I, I can yeah, see it. Yeah, we can see yeah. it. Cool. Oh. What do all of the symbols in it mean? Like it has your age and then like different. Age and time and uh, uh, second, I think. Yeah. Oh, cool. That's cool. I remember not really having any idea what that was going to look like because I know we talked about it in suit production. The sun. But no, the uh, oh. the wrist VFX. Oh, the wrist. The wrist, yeah. yeah. I had a, I had a pretty good idea of what the sandwich would look like. It was pretty simple. <laughs> <laughs> it's not the bread and cheese the piece of cheese. I, I just that. couldn't wrap my wrap. I was like, but why doesn't she just really use the full cheese? Yeah. yeah. But I no, think I think the I think the VFX on the wrist looks really really good. I so think really cool. in one of the film festival last year, when that oh shot came god. up, somebody was like, "Oh god." <laughs> <laughs> the the sandwich or the wrist? The sandwich, yeah. That's <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Here's Ray. Hey. Yeah. Woo! That's all we can do. How much longer? A week. I love kids. I could babysit. Not today. <laughs> No. So in the horror watch. version of this, Susumu, when Mia know. starts killing everybody, does she kill <laughs> Ray too? Uh -huh. <laughs> the, uh, walking dead. Well, I think she would be the first to go. Ray is the first one. I <laughs> think that's fair. Yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. What was it like, Momoka? Know. You know, doing these scenes. I don't think yeah. I. I gave you enough direction. It's like kind of kept playing stuff on the floor. It worked. I was just doing random things with sticks on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> <I don't know. laughs> 
Honestly, when in doubt, just do random things with sticks on the ground. Yeah. <laughs> I respect it. it. <laughs> Andrew Station. This announcement is brought to you by the city of Submit and Re uh, the, the scene on the wall. That's really cool. Yeah, it's really cool. I like that it's in different languages too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The shop I got it from like Korea and I Pakistan or like uh, India. So that's why it has like a. Oh God! I forgot I'm in this movie. Oh really? Yes. Oh God! Oh, where? Can you guys tell where he's? I'm not, I'm not gonna say who I am, but I just <laughs> what? remembered. Really? I just, what? Yeah. Wait, are you in this bus scene? Allegedly. So there's no, Molly, you can't prove it. Uh -huh. Molly, sorry. I know, she Is wasn't. that your hair? Let me see your hand. What? I'm not, I'm not actually sure if I pop up again. We'll see if I do. Yeah, you don't. Where he was? Oh, how do... Please let me go to the river. I want to go to the river. Go to the river. Am I gonna be there? I think nope. it's the first one. I think it's just that one shot. Yeah. He steps up on the yeah. What? He he was Missed a driver. It. I, I play the bus driver. Bus driver. Did you? With the completion yep. of brand new retirement mm -hmm. homes, awesome. oh. I have a little hat on. The oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The now, qu question, the Susumu. My uh, my connection's kind of choppy right now. Is that going to affect the recording? Mine's too. Oh. Mine too. Yeah, it's a bit choppy. Yeah. Here. I'm not sure. Uh, it could be just. Oh, God. Just the Have connection. You? Well, good. my son is doing rest after today uh, on the internet. You're good. Like, oh, like, okay. Come. Maybe that's why. You're gonna be okay. I'm gonna uh, be in the I car, so um, I'll be watching, but I won't have my video on. on okay. Okay. Really okay. Striking. And I asked who drew this, and there she was. It still looks choppy too. Working as a server. <laughs> it's better than it was. But it's still a little choppy. But still, yeah. Yeah. Pitched, yeah. Uh, a one sheet for a, a campaign. I think it's probably just yes, the internet, unfortunately. Okay. okay, let's see. Well, hopefully it doesn't affect the recording, but I guess we'll find out together. Yep. Yeah. We'll find out together. We'll as find out. As a team. Yes. <laughs> oh, I see the skull. Mm -hmm. You see oh, the skull shit. Yeah. I need to look for the yeah. skull. Look yeah. for the skull in the top. Like, when it comes Sorry, shoot. Head. There's, no, don't, no worries. There's, there will be a tilt up. To the relocation has up. always been on uh, an in okay. agent deployment, scorch search, but they don't have enough manpower to migrate 30 million senior members of our city. So they hired us to create a campaign. Now, it's also really creepy that they don't have eyeballs, I know. right? Right? Yeah, yeah. 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 Mom's <laughs> Just... I yeah. Wanna... choice he made. I think it works That's really well. It yeah. works really well. Mm -hmm. Mover state what? Back in 10th century Japan, in the time of famine, the peasant took their elderly on their shoulders and climbed up the mountain on foot and left them there. Because they had 10 kids and couldn't take care of them. This is a story I heard from my grandma. grandma. They call the mountain. Uh, there you I go. See it. Oh, uh, oh, okay. The I see it. And the nose. That's really nose. good. All right. yeah. Wow. I didn't ask for it. He, the Ed, he just did that. The, yeah. He just did oh, really? Oh, yeah. All right. Oh, wow. That's great. He's like, Susumu, I did There's something. History. <laughs> oh, cool. Anytime, anytime somebody starts with that, you know, it's yeah. going to be either really good or really terrible. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, uh -huh. Thankfully, he's, he's good at it. So. I love it. It's patriotic and sacrificial. I'm going to take this upstairs 
and we're gonna see what they say. I love all these expressions you're you doing. You don't mind nice. waiting down here? No. Just like tiny little movements, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's so awesome. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> the, the, it was the, so much fun. The sum was also <laughs> the, so awesome. Yeah. <laughs> Did good job. Good job. Momoka is coming up. Yeah. Woo! Woo! Yay! I know this doll is supposed to be really dramatic, but all I can think about is how Geneva adopted it as her boyfriend. <laughs> did. Oh, that's so and funny. was just like, this is my boyfriend, the doll. Right. <laughs> There's another poster behind this shop. I saw that. What does oh, it yeah. say on it? I think it's uh, supposed to be like a. I have um, to go. Get up, pick up my kids. Okay. Like a watch, the sand watch, I'll like the one that you go to. You know? um, You're saying that you know there's a limit to your time, oh, so use like it wisely. Why don't you go join us? Yeah. Oh, I'll go. God. I'll go. That's so cool. Come on, it would be good for you. Introduce yourself. I'll come join you later. I think you should have taken their sandwiches, Mia. <laughs> <laughs> just right snatched there. Them right yeah. Their sandwiches look oh, so oh. much better than your sandwiches. You should have <laughs> taken the sandwiches. <laughs> I should just snatch it. Yeah. Molly? Molly? I love that. Back to the face. <laughs> oh. <laughs> What's in the moment? <laughs> you worry too much. Go get your sandwich. Ooh, oh <laughs> <my God. laughs> the eyebrow is killing it. Oh. <laughs> <That> killer smile. <laughs> the killer smile. I was like looking at it, it's like my smile's like too big uh -huh. in this. Like no. it's like no, it's unnaturally so wide. <laughs> no, it's, it's a good thing though. But, yeah. In a just... good way. Like I don't normally smile like that. So it's like, <laughs> Extra creepy. It is. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna unhinge your jaw and swallow yeah. her. It's just gonna <laughs> keep open her. Like exactly. <laughs> exactly. It's hurt. I also love that transition mm -hmm. from the yeah. poster. Yeah. 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 That's so cool. Where was this shot at? Cause this looks re this it's looks like a so. So we only train. shot the train, just the inside of the train. Yeah. Outside oh, is a pause. So the mountain doesn't exist. That's it. That's one of the nice things about this is that it's yeah. it doesn't seem like our reality in a sense. It's a little bit removed, mm -hmm. but mm -hmm. it's so seamless with this yeah. new reality. Yeah, that's awesome. It looks familiar, yeah. but not familiar at the same time. Like, yeah, what is that again? Huh? Yeah. <laughs> and that was a fun shoot because we shot at Train Town in Griffith Park. Yep. Yeah. And we had basically oh, the whole so run cool. of the train, which was fun. Ooh. Mm -hmm. That's awesome. Yeah, we saw a bus outside uh, in the parking lot and then the train inside. Mm -hmm. And it was the first day. Uh, oh, that's right. That was where the bus was, too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. We saw oh, that's all, the first day? day. That's mm -hmm. a, that's a big first day. It was yeah, an ambitious was. first day. Yeah. Because <clears throat> you said you I had people it. outside the bus, like, oh, making the... Sitter. Yeah. Mm -hmm. wow. So yeah. there's two 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 gaffers outside. They were sort of like throwing mirrors around, and then mm -hmm. the light's supposed to hit wow. it. Wow. It give you the the effect of like, you know, it's moving. Car passing. Yeah. And, it's just moving. and then Daga so was cool. shaking the camera just enough to make it look like it was in motion. Yeah. Oh. oh. This thing always. Okay. I know. I, I, yeah. Especially the fact that she accepts it, it's what's yeah, with her. Like she's like, okay, like she, yeah. she's accepting it. You can still mm -hmm. Mom, have to go.
to go. Bye, Mary. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I didn't realize she's not in the zoom anymore. Do you know? Oh, she stepped up. Oh, I think she, she left. Where old people then. like Mary go? Oops. They eat ice cream all day and watch movies. Yeah, it like was unfortunate we didn't <laughs> get uh, her close up. Silly. You're not yeah. Old enough. Yeah. Oh, that tear. That tear. I think it works yeah. really well, though, still. I think, I think it, it does. Yeah. Mm. And then she goes in and chops Ray into pieces. <laughs> she grabs the axe. <laughs> she pulls it out of her sleeve. <laughs> And then for me, the miracle was this light reflection coming up. Yeah. That oh, is, yeah. It just happened. It didn't. It's oh, nice. And, and it's yeah. just so cool. I just, did you guys see, like, the oh, angel is right here. Hmm? Yeah. Oh, oh, angel. Yeah. The, in the yeah. back. Mm -hmm. oh, back there. Oh, I know. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's so cool. Oh, how cool. Oh, wow. oh, it was also oxygen. Like, we did that oh, on wow. purpose. That was deliberate. <laughs> really? Everything is yeah. on purpose. So Sumu was like, this angel needs to be yeah. here and this yeah. flash of lightning nice. needs to happen. Good landing. I it's all I part of, of his off, process. Yes. It just seems uh, so forward. so incidental but perfect for the yeah. moment. Yeah, I know. Planned. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, but that, that was such a nice find on that house, right? Like, it's it, yeah. it was sitting right there. It was perfect. It's just mm -hmm. perfect. Oh my yeah. god. Wow. I mean, I hated the house because it was gross and sticky, but <laughs> it looks really good on camera. Yeah, it looks yep. so cool. Very true. Yeah. It looks really gross and sticky on camera. Yeah, yeah it does. Mm -hmm. right there with the fixing of the hat she mm -hmm. came up with it becky came up with it like she's like oh i'm going to just kind of fix the hat to say like oh i'm ready for the next yeah. adventure kind of oh that's cool yeah that was a good good uh good info yeah i like becky she's she's great yeah i, I love awesome. her mm -hmm. she's awesome she's so sweet such a great shot of Mia too. It's so good. Getting goosebumps. <laughs> and the music? The mountain. Is, yeah, the uh, music. Yeah. Oh, I'm just ready for her to just lift that axe in the frame. <laughs> <laughs> We always oh, get get quiet at the end. I know. <laughs> so we just all like we're caught, we're caught all. up in it. We're enjoying it. It's so good. <laughs> oh my There's god. There's really nothing else to say here. You know? Subscribe to Dust for new sci-fi. Well, except for subscribe to Dust for new sci-fi for your bees. Yeah. Yes. It's actually pretty cool. <laughs> yes. You gonna go order a bunch of hoodies? Yeah. Why not? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, there Dust. There you go. Thank you, Dust. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yep. Thank you. So Momoka is out. Out? Yeah. Is I guess she gonna she, come back? Or she must have gotten dis I don't know. She must have gotten disconnected, but she didn't say that she was leaving, so mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, if she comes back, I'll let let her in the yeah. but... Okay. Just to say one final goodbye. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well that was really cool. Um that was super I guess cool. before we <laughs> 
<laughs> and so Andrew. much fun. I forgot Andrew <laughs> was in, in the background. The <laughs> 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 Is yeah. there a VFX shot that kind of like stands out at you for the entire short film? Because I know sci-fi is no stranger to VFX, but is uh -huh. there one that's like your particular, like your favorite one? Oh, uh, I mean, definitely the the internment camp shot is definitely my favorite because that was exactly how I was picturing it when I was writing it. Like I had all the references and what's happening and everything. Like it literally starts on that uh shot when i was writing it um because the idea for me was the ubaste ama story that the discarding of you know lady on the mountain story however horrible that is it got connected to japanese internment camp as a reference that's where mm -hmm. i my 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 mind started to work so i was picturing the exact same picture um from the same photographer, uh, Ansel Adams' picture. Um, so everything was about that. So when that came out, I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Because <laughs> like, I, I, cause you also guys are also writers too. So I feel like you almost feel like you write something and then picturing it all, all in your head so much. And then when it comes out, just the way you picture it, it's just like, why? <laughs> it's so it's so amazing so that's that's what happened with that one so i was very proud and uh that's uh kazu my friend kazu -san. uh he's he's a japanese uh great bfx um artist he pretty much worked out on his own and uh finished it nice. uh, so yeah very proud of that very nice very nice Mia, I have a yes. question for you too. Oh, yes. I love that you've just stepped in to do this impromptu yeah. QA. I <laughs> genuinely love it. Like it's, you, gotta have it, you gotta have it at the very end. There. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, Mia, what would you say would be your favorite scene of the entire movie um, uh, that you had to like perform? Oh, it's uh, it's it's so hard to choose one. Um I loved everything I'm in. <laughs> that's good and she's I mean... very humble too <laughs> the scenes that and... i'm not in i'm just thinking you know maybe uh... i could be in these scenes <laughs> <laughs> uh but it's been well probably at the end because you know it's just uh she stands up for what she believes and it just i think the character chase represent conscience and hope in humanity and uh, you know it was such an honor to play her I shared a little bit of my uh, personal connection to her in the uh, in the zoom session earlier we had mm -hmm. um, um, you know on my own struggle in life and um, how I connected to it I mean we all have you know something to cope with in our lives but uh, mine was like some um uh, connected to some like a violence physically and mentally mm -hmm. and, and so um so because of that um in certain amount of time I felt like I'm voiceless mm -hmm. and you know I don't have anything to say and I felt so small and closed off and I think we all can relate to those feelings you know and so playing chase really taps me in into you know, um, let me rephrase that, uh, like gaining back my power mm -hmm. to express more and, you know, and the standing up for, for whatever, you know, important to her or for others. So, um, so because of that, uh, playing Chase really gives me hope and, mm -hmm. and, you know, she's, the part in me is still growing as an artist and human being. So, um, so I would say, ending of the film will be my favorite. So, it's a great yeah. scene. Yeah, it's a yeah. great shot, Susumu. Yeah, if there was one thing that you would hope 
an audience member will take away from the movie at the very end? What do you hope they take away? Uh, well, I think just reading through the comments, I think a lot of people got it, which is that you make a choice yourself. Like you, um, I mean, I hope, I hope I make the same choices as, as she does in the film, which is to basically say no to um, something that she doesn't feel right. Mm -hmm. Even though the choice is hard and it may, in the scheme of all the world and the system and all that big, big stuff, maybe it doesn't matter just helping your neighbor, right? Mm -hmm. um, but I hope to do the same when the decision comes to me. Um, so it became hopeful uh, because of her choices at the end. It because I because you know this was a long process. The couple first version that I wrote wasn't that. It wasn't. It wasn't. It was a more cynical story, um, which we just kind of find out that this you know so horrible society is killing all people, and then done done, and that that's that was the end. Uh, in, that was in the, the, the the final twist. Yeah, and there was a final final twist, and it was like, oh, got kind of gotcha movie that I was make trying to make. Mm -hmm. But then, um, twenty sixteen happened, and I was like, oh, I can't, you know, I have to make something hopeful. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I feel like I need to, I need. I'm to... glad you did. Yeah, well, I, 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 I really, I really like that honestly, and I feel like it's, it's a, it's a really interesting, different kind of cool, mature way to take the story because I feel like a lot of people would have it be, oh no, they're killing the old people, and that's sort of it so mm -hmm. i really like that you're you know it's it feels kind of obvious from the get-go that that's what's happening it's never really treated as a twist mm -hmm. it's just sort of everyone in this world has accepted that that's what this reality is and mm -hmm. you know if you do get to make this a larger version i'm really excited to see exploring with chase like what her role is in that and how she feels being this literal instrument of propaganda but also kind of the figurehead because she's created this program that's making people think oh this terrible thing that's happening we know it's happening but now we kind of think it's cool mm -hmm. and i you know i love seeing her grapple with you know being culpable in that and then realizing that she wants to make a change i feel like that's going to be really really interesting to watch yeah the fact is at the end she sort of she got the job right she gets the job yeah. And then, so she could she could be still working and doing horrible mm -hmm. things if she because it's like she do she's so. doing these awful things, but also she gets to feed her kids, and that's not something that she got to do before. So right. kind of seeing her weigh those two things against each other, I think, is really fascinating, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. you could do a lot with that. There's a lot yeah. of narrative groundwork there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely. I want to put up this question to everyone except Susumu. <laughs> so I'm interested in, in hearing everyone else's take. Is there anything that you kind of discovered yourself upon multiple viewings of the film that you didn't realize on your first time or even reading the script? Uh -huh. I didn't know there was a skull in the cloud. Oh, yeah. <laughs> until today. <laughs> yeah, I didn't know there was a skull in the cloud. Yeah. Oh, um, oh that's a good question. Yeah, that's a good question. I have to think. Ray, was there anything you noticed? Yeah, well, yeah. So, thinking, um, besides I'm, I'm, the skull, <laughs> yeah, the, yeah the, well, um, the the angel in the back, the angel, mm -hmm. and uh, the the sandwiches. Mm. <laughs> I never really noticed the details of how there because there's sam multiple sandwiches in this, and then there's mm -hmm. different <laughs> yeah. levels to them. From one mm -hmm. sandwich being made, and then later in the film, another sandwich passes by, and then right. another sandwich is being built. Um, at, it, it you don't really read too much into it but you can and you wonder you know like it, it shows a little bit about the person's background and what they have for resources and you know all that mm -hmm. um so it, again it, it adds to that sense of realism um but i would say I, I think one thing i pick up out out of all of this when i watch it again and again i just i love the details in this from the mm -hmm. artwork to the the little um detail of the the jacket coming apart and mm -hmm. then especially yeah. just the facial expressions that everybody has when they're confronting 
their reality, um, something new happening. I, I just, I love the details and, uh, and, and how it combines with the details in the artwork that comes up throughout. And mm -hmm. it kind of makes you realize how powerful details are. And, and when it, they're put up into artwork for everybody to see, then it becomes like you, you can see this, this um, shift happening where some artwork can be used as propaganda. Some can be have, can have this subversive level to kind of um, uproot whatever the propaganda is all about. So mm -hmm. there's like that polar opposites happening. And then there's mm -hmm. a artwork in the middle that's more about escape for your personal self. So mm -hmm. it's very interesting to see that pendulum shift throughout mm -hmm. the story when these details come up and different elements within the artwork comes up. You can feel the the emotional pendulum of the story just going one way and then, and then sweep another way. And uh, yeah, so I, I just, I love that about the film. And that's yeah. what I kind of discovered in keep getting out of it <laughs> yeah, nice thank, thank you yeah. yeah definitely the poster for me was like one i i was picturing like maybe three or four and i won't want to be like really disgusting like the monster one it's like because i mm -hmm. saw some of those like po propaganda posters from mm -hmm. you know back in world war ii where you know people treat the enemy as like the monster kind of stuff. So demon want, kind of creature. Yeah. yeah. But I also want something to be sort of like a kind of beautiful and nice because, you know, the danger of the propaganda is that you are hooked into the beauty and, and, and how good it looks. So you mm -hmm. sort of captivated by that fact. So mm -hmm. I want, I want the poster that the Mia draws to be that poster where it's like, Oh, it's sort of, I don't know what's going on, but it looks cool and it looks mm -hmm. good. It kind of it then, brings you in, yeah, because it's interesting yeah, it and does. it's visually like it's cool to look at. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But then you find out what the reason behind it is like, oh shit, that's, yeah, yeah. that's yeah. pretty yeah. That's yeah. Pretty yeah. Very dark. Up, really you know? dark. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but thanks for yeah, picking that up. What about you, Molly? Did you notice any any new details? Um, I did actually. Um there's um I mean I really like like all the artwork and there was something that I noticed that when on the train when it's going the thing that comes up on the wall it's actually mm -hmm. in Spanish and I do speak Spanish but I now I can't tell you what it says but I was like it was really cool to be able to like see it, the advertisement like in another language and be like oh yeah wow yes. that's, that's so cool yeah. um and then the other thing I noticed that there is there is graffiti kind of everywhere and like even on top of buildings and I wasn't sure if like the graffiti is um maybe more of obviously like the maybe people that aren't like against the propaganda or if this was just like normal graffiti because it looked like mm -hmm. wings kind mm -hmm. of like a little bit but I don't know if that was a coincidence or uh no it was a design yes yeah yeah okay so it's like a, it's like a uh it's like a you know like a let's say it's a banksy art and then yeah you know when when you see the banksy art you realize there's a meaning behind it mm -hmm. um, yeah. so the idea was that uh, this so-called resistance groups in the river the old people um <laughs> they draw this marking basically it's a mountain plus river oh yeah. Oh, so, cool. yeah. yeah. So there's yeah. like, a, and, okay. And Japanese character, uh, uh, it's called kanji. There's a type of character called kanji, um, and it's made out of um, um, the actual, uh, like draw actual drawing of what what it would look like, and you simplify it, and then that how that's how the lot of the, lot of the characters are, are created. Oh, so, cool. so mountain shapes like this and okay. then river shapes like a three three lines mm -hmm. three okay. lines yeah. yeah so i wanted to do that with the three line at the bottom and the one mountain sign at the top so i kind of designed it and i started to put it together in a lot of different scenes okay. yeah um, i really liked it that you could see it and i mean i noticed it more in this viewing throughout in yeah. different scenes um it's obviously more obvious in like behind the house you mm -hmm. know yep. but it is kind of all over the place which i was i thought that was really interesting but yeah. you like n notice that it's like not like the other you know artwork in the city it's like 
very specific. So mm-hmm. I really mm-hmm. enjoyed that. Yeah. Yeah. No. That's very cool. That's no. that's the feeling I was getting watching it again and again. So you could feel this, this yeah, that sway from or a, a battle of the arts in a sense. You know, yeah. one mm-hmm. side doing one with the art forms, and the other side doing another. You could feel that kind of back mm-hmm. and forth pull, and then Mia is sort of like in the center of it all, just like, like finding yeah. finding the center with you know within all of this. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Very, very cool. Very, yeah. very cool. <laughs> I would say, yeah, mine was like numbers of the symbol. Like mm. I knew the meaning of it because Susumu told me about it before. So it's like sort of symbol of the resistance and, you mm-hmm. know, Riba people do that. And then I knew about it. But today I see like more and more of it. And I didn't yep. notice that before. Oh, there's more here. There's more here. So it was mm-hmm. really cool to see. Wow. Mm-hmm. Like, yeah. Yeah, like, so, I don't know if you can see yeah. it, but this shot has three three of them here. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Right oh, cool. Yeah. So, yeah. Oh, yeah. That I, I, I haven't, yeah, yeah. I haven't yeah. noticed Those these at there. all either. Okay. Yeah, they're there. <laughs> and, yeah. And then, it might, because I saw them so fast in my head, I was like, those are wings. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you wouldn't. I could see how you would, yeah. I could see how they could be wings. Yeah. 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 The one yeah, right here. yeah. The wings. Right. So cool. It has that in, uh, other interpretation of like wings are flying away from. It goes yeah. with the angels. That's cool. that was completely it goes with deliberate. the angels. <laughs> the angels. I like that. I, I like that. The angel was going to be for some planned. Yeah. Whoa! Wow. <laughs> the tough one. Wow. Was this 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 uh this one. On the wall over there. Yeah, right here. Yeah, I noticed that one oh, too. I didn't know that one. Yeah, because wow. I was like, he they they have to have it on the actual location, otherwise they wouldn't recognize it. So so I, I had to put right. it there. Yeah. And we could have easily spray painted that for real. We could have done that practically <laughs> for um, real, right? There yeah. was no one there to stop us. <laughs> very true, very true. <laughs> and I think this uh, Spanish word for yeah, um, uh, I think I it's think back this is a little bit farther. What Tony came up uh, with. It. Wait, yeah. Is it oh that's no sorry that's not spanish it's it's latin. that's latin right it's latin yeah. something sinister i think molly that... just wanted to yeah. brag that she speaks other languages <laughs> <laughs> she didn't think we'd go she, back and check she so she fast in my head I was like, yeah. she's like by the way guys i speak happy. spanish yeah. <laughs> wow no i'm gonna look it up now yeah Creates. Tony came up on her, himself and it was like, hey, yeah, that's so cool. Let's do that. And I know sick cool. is so, and then creatus would be create. Uh, Mundus is world. Mundus. World, I think. Or like it's kind of like an Illuminati thing, I think. So, so it's, it's like, similar. so so is born the world, kind of, I think. I see. Oh, that's cool. the okay, world is created. You would know this. Oh. Ah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's the yeah, world I, was created. Sorry, yeah. That oh, was I, it was like I was on the train and I saw it in passing and I barely read it. it so <laughs> <laughs> you recognize that's the most important thing. <laughs> yeah. I just saw Mundas and I was like, Mundas. Uh, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Yep. So there you go. That's so cool. Oh. Wow. <laughs> yeah it, it's so cool now you know everybody can visit this house you know how many times mm-hmm. they want or being bored oh, or whatever so but cool. if they want to they can just kind of times. <laughs> to some, to some times. Times. Discover the cool things that I, wait know, before I, we wrap I, this up how many views do we have now let's see it oh yeah uh, have we gone up at all ooh, ooh. 24 Oh shit! Woo! All right. Woo! So Woo! during during one hour, we got uh, we got two thousand more views. Two thousand more. Wow. Views. Yeah. That, that's pretty outrageous. That's crazy. That's mm-hmm. almost amazing. That's yeah. awesome. Yeah. That's well, congrats, amazing. Asumu. I think I think this has been a really amazing project, and I think mm-hmm. you've got a lot that you can just feel yeah. very good about with this. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And honestly, I mean, that I, goes that goes for everybody. I think every yeah. you know every no, single yeah. person on this project Seriously? has yeah has done a really really good job, and I think it shows. Yeah, everybody yeah. brought their A yeah. games. 
something that you may not realize that you 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 had something you know like the molly's you know you know um <laughs> crazy villain, her job. villainous looks and stuff like that you know <laughs> <laughs> but uh yeah that's that's been a blessing for me to hear that everybody's mm-hmm. getting something out of this you know um not just being in a movie but like you got to you know explore yourself or the new things dis- discover new things and you know trying new things i to me that's 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 the most uh blessed things to hear so thank you thank you thank you for having yeah, us thank you. thank you for putting really us all together i'm excited to see <laughs> what happens with the rest of submit yeah. I know. With your yeah. advancing. So yeah, no pressure, right? No pressure. <laughs> no pressure, none whatsoever. No pressure. You take all the time you need to make it perfect. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right, everybody's well, just yeah. excited to see yeah. what goes Real quick, next. who remembers these buttons? Oh, oh we were talking about the buttons earlier. <laughs> yeah, I, I remember. I didn't take this from. I didn't steal them. I didn't, I didn't take. No, they're, no, no. They're I not, think I gave it to you. This was like from our first get together after finishing the movie. You had like yes, right. I, buttons to give out to friends and family, room, right? And I, I did. Yeah. yeah. Yes. But su- super cool. It's just one of those things of like the dedication of everybody involved, just giving a uh, hundred percent and more to mm-hmm. you know making this movie happen. So. Oh, yeah thank you yeah. yeah no i have a bunch of them in my house i i, I can give it give it all to you guys <laughs> i wasn't sure what to do with it actually so it's, if you want it, eBay. I can give it to you. Right. <laughs> i'll trade you more to keep the mockingbird buttons Oh, you have <laughs> tequila mockingbird. I love yeah, it. We, have, we have so many tequila we have pins we have buttons we have so oh. many yeah uh, we're gonna make some mitts and t-shirts t-shirt? t-shirt yeah, all right yeah that'll be the next step <laughs> um before yeah. before we let you go just uh let's go through the you know everybody's updates on what you're doing and uh uh doesn't have to you can say the same thing as the first one or oh, yeah. there's more more stuff that you can talk about uh i love to hear it so okay Mia, do you want to start us off yeah. oh yeah sure so i've been working on this uh feature film um uh, LGBTQ themed uh, takes place in Japan, 80s Japan. So where di- where everything is far from diversity. So it's kids POV uh, film, you know, see things, I mean, see prejudice and discrimination through kids' eyes. So um, so I'm working on that, but uh, the reader producer had a stroke a few months ago. So we are kind of taking it slow now, but we are moving it surely, slowly but surely. And and then other project I'm working is a short film. Uh, it's about um, middle-aged romance and um, uh, loss of loved ones and suffering and grief and um, liberation from it. So it's a lot of focus on mental illness and and which I'm really passionate about too. And I'm going to produce and direct the film too. Oh so, wow! Okay. I'm Wonderful. Scary. I'm scared, but yeah, but yeah. you got this. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. And so, and I also booked a voiceover project uh, for animation pilot. So I'm gonna mm-hmm. play a lot of different roles, and That's awesome. I'm so excited. About That's it. really cool. Yeah. How about you, Molly? Uh, I have a few projects that I'm working on on getting them up and running. My sister is a novelist and it's a steampunk western. So I'm working on producing different lengths of um, either teaser and or like a short film, depending on the budget that we get for it, Mm -hmm. which is really excited to get to work on a project with my sister because I've been reading her work since I was like, really little anytime she'd write oh, something nice. oh, read wow. it. so it's really exciting to get that's to so work cool. with her on a project um that's her own work um mm-hmm. and uh, I wrote uh, a short film that I really like to make this year so figuring that out as well it's about uh healing from uh domestic violence mm-hmm. and um my partner and I wrote a <laughs> 
Uh, I don't know why I giggle when I say it. So we wrote a rom com. <laughs> it's a Christmas it's so rom com. It's adorable, and um, so you have a lot of projects working on, which is really nice. Uh, like it feels really empowering to, to also do your own things. Mm-hmm. Um, and I'm just excited about getting those getting those rolling and trying to figure out getting how to them out in the world. Getting them out in the world. Yeah. Hell yeah. It's wow. Exciting. How about you, Ray? Um, well, one thing I want to share with everybody is this is my second film for the Dust Network. Um, another one. Oh, oh and then that's actually cool. came out this past October. It's called Straw Man. So oh. you guys should check it oh, out. Man. Look it up. Yeah. Um, yeah. They have it listed awesome. on there. Send us um, link, please. Yeah, I can I can put in a link if you guys. Yeah, so, please do. Yes, please. Yeah. Yeah. When Here was this? Word. Here it is. <laughs> Yeah, so in this film, I'm I play a father during the um great um uh what is it called not, not the great not the Great Depression the the Dust Bowl era oh and, yeah, yeah um in this film I'm uh I'm just myself and my daughter on this farmland and we're about to lose our uh, farm to the the banks um, as mm-hmm. was happening to a lot of farmers at that time mm-hmm. and this film had it since it's on the Dust Network it has an element of sci-fi fantasy to it mostly fantasy like. Um, our um, scarecrow on the farm comes to life and tries to save the day to save the family's farm and everything. So it's a, it's mm. you could say it's, it's scary sounding because you know scarecrows coming to life sounds mm. pretty horrific. <laughs> but this film depends on what they want to do to you, I guess. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> right. This form, this film has more of like a, 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 I don't know, like a sweet nature about it it's it's it really brings home like the meaning of family and friends and all of that um mm. and you can kind of feel this this connection that, that the scarecrow has with this family so it's very very cute film um i'm the father at the beginning and, and then i kind of come around at the end of the movie um but it, it's just one of these wonderful things like this film it's just a blessing to be a part of so let me see if i can share that that yeah please do that's yes, awesome please. Uh, that's how do we do that chat okay so i'm going to this and anybody that's watching this you can easily find it by just looking up on in youtube the search just put in straw man it's two separate words straw like the straw that's in a um scarecrow Mm -hmm. and then man Uh okay okay yeah it's a wonderful little film um so definitely definitely check it out and um another thing that's coming up in february i was able to do um be a part of this show with pierce brosnan for the history channel because he's doing this he's a host you know pierce brosnan Mm -hmm. um james bond 007 and and this so that's why this is a perfect match for him this is a history's greatest heists so Mm -hmm. i've heard of this show i'm in yeah i'm in one of the episodes as um a mystery agent man nice nice <laughs> so um so yeah and um uh, just working as much as i can here and there on different things and um yeah and and my new year's resolution this year is get into shape get into real good shape so i'm just okay. working on fitness as much as i can too so yeah wow. i'm trying to get that one pull up Oh, <laughs> we'll <laughs> just the first one. Right. That's all I need. Uh, the first one, and then it's, you're off. To the yeah. <laughs> Did, didn't I see you lift some like heavy stuff on Instagram, Molly? Yeah, I've you, been you... doing a lot of heavy. Oh, things. she can do more than one pull up. I guarantee. Yeah. Well, not pull ups. I can do a lot of hip thrusts with a lot of weight, but the pull ups is not there yet. But oh, it's okay. okay. <laughs> Whoa! Amazing. Wow. Well, I've got uh, two feature films that we're wrapping up right now. We're towards the very end of post-production for both of them. Uh, The one that I wrote and directed, it's called This Sucks. It's a dark comedy about depression. The main character has a demon following her around. It's the physical manifestation of her depression. Mm -hmm. And the second one is a documentary about the legendary bodybuilder Tony Pearson. That one is called uh, Driven. And I'm actually going to let our surprise moderator say a few things about that one because he directed it. What? Oh, awesome. Since he's here, he can speak to it better than I can. Ooh, yay! Hi, my name's Andrew Menjivar. I had nothing to do with submitting, but nothing whatsoever. <laughs> Absolutely. Pretty dirty. Pretty dirty. 
<laughs> um, <laughs> is a documentary about, as Karen mentioned, the legendary bodybuilder Tony Pearson. He comes from the golden era of bodybuilding, and he has a pretty incredible story. And the whole documentary is really, it's not just like a sports documentary about the whole you know, the sport of bodybuilding. It's his whole life story. And he has an incredible life story of overcoming uh, just child abuse, uh, the deep embedded racism in the South. And, you know, just essentially trying to survive in a world that just doesn't want him. Mm-hmm. And that's the whole documentary. Wow. Incredible. I've seen the footage. It looks great. Yeah, well, it I does. really want to see it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah, I really so- want to see it. Andrew and I are making these two features at the exact same time because we're fools, um, but they're almost done. They're probably honestly a couple weeks away from being finished, which is pretty Ooh. incredible. Uh, Susumu did the VFX on This Sucks, uh, to which I am eternally grateful for him because <laughs> there ended up being a lot of VFX for that movie. Um, but yeah, so th- things are coming together. Uh, can't make any official announcements yet, but keep February 25th free on your calendars. Just throwing that out there for no reason. February <laughs> 25th. February 25th. Just for February 25th. Just 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 for no reason whatsoever. Just you know, February 25th. <laughs> and uh Susumu, you want to close us out? Uh so yeah, I'm uh like I said, I'm writing uh, a future length version of this film. Um, maybe TV series. I don't know. Um, I know the world is. Uh, I know uh, we we came up with a world um uh, that could have a lot of stories. So I'm interested in developing some. Maybe I have some other uh friends with me to write more series sort of script. Maybe. Um, the idea is lot. There's a lot of ideas out there, but I want to sort of get my hands go at it first so um i have an outline um written um i'm saying to these two wonderful uh people cameron and mia first and and see how yeah, they feel about it uh because i want to keep mm-hmm. working with all of you guys again if possible um and uh yeah um i'm pretty excited about it and uh yeah um I'm, I have another script idea that I want to uh, make uh, as I make submit in the future. Um, so, but you know, like like Ray said, the new my New Year's goal is to keep keep at it, keep working, um, doing. Well, he said things. that about pull ups, so that's not quite oh, the okay. same as scripts. Uh, yeah, I guess so. Yeah, I I, I can't do four. But <laughs> <laughs> that's that's not idea. Yeah. But uh, yeah, like you know, um. I, 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 I'm going to keep working on this. So um, I love to hear. Uh, I, I'm so happy to hear from everybody's response today, um, and uh, uh, I hope to give you guys something much bigger than what you just watched today. And uh, uh, please follow us. Uh, we have a website launch submitten.com. Uh, we're active on social media, Instagrams and Facebooks, and um you know we have a lot of support groups in making this so we kind of feel like i'm growing uh, a lot of audience so yes yeah please please keep us uh, uh in your <laughs> that's a weird way to say keep us in your thoughts <laughs> keep us in your thoughts keep, keep us in, in mind keep us in mind yeah. uh yeah and uh thoughts we'll, and prayers yes we'll we'll try not to disappoint you and 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 uh, and uh Yes, that's it. <laughs> I'll, I'll set up now. <laughs> <laughs> well, to everybody who's been watching, thank you so much for watching. Uh, your support means the world. Keep us in your thoughts, as Susumu says, and uh, <laughs> we'll talk to you soon. Let us know what you think about the film. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you. Everyone. Thank you so much. Mm-hmm. And cut. <laughs>